Hey everyone, welcome to Alat 1061. Today I'm sitting in a beautiful new design Audi S5. Uh, available as a coupe now. It will be available with a uh, as a sportback variant and a convertible. But this one has a lot of new functions. I love the seats, the newly shaped seats. I love the Audi Virtual Cockpit. Beautiful done. This Audi S5 produces 354 horsepower, 500 Nm of torque in total. It has a quattro all wheel drive system, 0 to 62 in 4.7 seconds. The top speed is limited to 250 km per hour. It has a 3 liter V6 turbocharged engine. New 8 speed automatic transmission. Full LED matrix headlights with the dynamic turn signals in the front and in the rear. These are the most expensive headlights you can get. Specific Audi S5 front bumper and S5 grille with extra chrome and different design. This is the second generation. Later that year. Later this year, the Audi S5 Sportback will come and the S5 Convertible. New shape of the bonnet. Navara blue color. Special S5 rims. 19 inch, 255, 35, 19. These mirrors are also special for the S5, matte silver, camera underneath it, and it has the blind spot assist, tinted rear windows, 3D LED taillights, with the dynamic turn signals quad exhaust special diffuser again in grey the fuel capacity is 58 liters you can fold the seats down for more space in the back Frameless doors, carbon package, storage compartment down here. This is also lit up at night. It has the massage seats, leg extensions, 
special S5 seats with the S logo integrated. Beautiful. Audi virtual cockpit, which is also new. Blind spot assist. This carbon package looks amazing. Quattro badge on the dash. Lock, unlock, folding mirrors, heated as well. Quality items are used, storage area, trunk release, optional Bang & Olufsen sound system. And we are now in the beautiful interior of the Audi S5 Coupe. Adjustable armrest. One, two. It has a wireless charging point here, which is extra. USB, AUX input and a storage area beautiful S logo the gear lever is also a resting point for your wrist so you can control the MMI plus system this is for your key volume adjustments and music adjustments electronic hand brake auto hold so the car doesn't roll back when you release the brake this button is for park, down for drive, up for reverse, and it has a Tiptronic function. Extra buttons added and side menus. You can also write the address down on this. This also lit up at night. Two cup holders, push button ignition, keyless entry. Drive select, which is also new. These are the car modes available. Efficient, comfort, automatic, dynamic and individual. So you can set it up uh, separately for yourself. Start stop, you can turn it off. ESP, self parking system, parking sensors. You can turn the screen off. This is the camera view, front view, corner view, bird view, overhead view. So uh, uh, this is the rear view, corner view, rear. Very cool system. I like this part of this uh, camera system and the corner view of course beautiful system always look uh, out heated seats three settings for the driver and the passenger touch sensitive buttons automatic mode eco mode fan speed tree zone 
rear lovely carbon trim by the way this is the main menu of the car car settings the dynamic uh, the drive select sound settings for the Bang & Olufsen sound system 3D sound radio the media system it supports CarPlay and Android phone settings Bluetooth connectivity navigation this is the map three d amazing view amazing very cool done by audi audi connect audi smartphone interface these are the normal settings beautiful stitched leather steering wheel flat bottom design with the S logos it has of course the shift pedals behind the steering wheel voice activation and I love this Audi virtual cockpit and this gauge is special for the S5 for the S models you can see the S logo different views available this is so nice done by Audi it's amazing look at this system very very cool done I did a test drive with the brand new Audi a3 convertible with the Audi virtual cockpit you can find it on my channel of course it has the head-up display you can turn it on or off with this button here if it it was mine I will I would uh, leave it on all the time touch sensitive lights in the interior SOS button, microphones, LED lights in the interior 